This is a review of the z 20 degree sleeping bag. Uh, not gonna go super in depth. I uh, just wanna give you kind of the look and feel of the bag. Um, I bought this uh, a couple years ago now, so um, there might be some features that have changed on the current models. This is the extra long uh, regular width. Uh, I believe it measures at about 6'5". Uh, I'm 6'1", and when I'm fully in it, um, it just barely goes over my head. Um, the outside material is a material um, called Ventum. It's uh, similar to Pertex. From what I can tell, uh, it performs exactly the same as Pertex. Um, I kind of prefer the feel of it a little bit more than other Pertex jackets that I've uh, that I've owned, um, but uh, it zips, uh, you know, almost all the way down, and um, which means that it's pretty versatile. I've found it to be really nice if, uh, you know, it's it's hot, you can just use it as a quilt, um, and then obviously zips all the way up. At the top, there is a um, Velcro closure, just kind of goes over the zipper, and on the other side there is a drawstring. Uh, I've used this uh, for a number of different applications, not just fast backing, uh, I've used it uh, on climbing trips. Uh, the, I bought this bag for a through hike, uh, but it's proved to be a lot more versatile than that. I've used it um, you know, everything from car camping to, to climbing. Another feature is um, kind of the pseudo hood. Uh, when I bought it, I was under the impression that um, to be the warmest, you would lay on the zipper uh, because there's no baffle. Um, so by, you know, sleeping on top of the zipper, you basically have a fully enclosed system with no cold spots uh, created by a zipper. Um, but uh, I found that, and I don't know if this is just my bag or uh, if it's all of them, but that the when you have the zipper going uh, on top of you, that uh, the back is a little bit longer and it, it's, it's, pseudo, it's like a pseudo hood on the sleeping bag. Um, I've paired this uh, with uh, a down, like a lightweight down uh, hooded jacket, and that seems to be really perfect. Uh, I was nervous about having no hood on a bag, um, but I've found that by supplementing with a uh, lightweight down hooded jacket, uh, you're super warm. So you can put the hood on and have your head out of the bag and be pretty warm, or you can put the hood on and you know still kind of hunker down in it. Use this a lot with a bivy, um, and it, the material dries super quickly. Um, the fill is uh, 900, uh, 900 fill down, so uh, you know it lofts up pretty nice. And uh, even after you know a bunch of nights out there, it, it still lofts up pretty quick. Um, yeah, super simple bag, uh, you know. Not many bells and whistles, but that's kind of what you get with ultralight gear. The stuff sack that it comes with um, is a Cuban fiber stuff sack, so it's nice that uh, you get a little waterproof stuff sack. It doesn't uh, compress the bag very much at all. It's got Velcro uh, with a buckle, so it makes for a nice roll top closure. So you know uh, it's, it's pretty waterproof. Um, the whole thing, weighs in at about 19 ounces and uh um it you know it's been a great bag for me